I'm going to show you guys the best defenders you can use in FC 24 foot champions. Let's hit 100 likes on the video, subscribe if you're new, and comment down below who is the favorite defender of yours that you've used so far this year. If you want the cheapest FC 24 coins to get ahead of the competition, check out MMO EXP by clicking the link down below and use code JAMBU for 5% off. So every defender on this list is going to be under 100k coins. They're all going to be meta, which means that they're good defenders that can be used at the highest level in order to make sure you guys are getting the most wins possible. So we do have William Saliba, 6 foot 4 Great pace, great defending, great physicals, and he's also good on the ball. It's sad that he doesn't have any playstyle plus, but he does have the jockey and anticipate, along with power header, which are some really nice ones to have. We then have Kim Min Jae. This guy, he just reminds me of one of those sweaty centre-backs that they don't look spectacular, but they just play incredible in game. He's six foot three, you know, good pace, defending and physical as you'd expect. He's got the power header, intercept, slide tackle and aerial, uh, which in my opinion is broken. The aerial one, they just do not lose a header. So I would definitely recommend giving him a go. We then have Alfonso Davies, who obviously strong links to Kim Min Jae. Four star, four star. And he's just one of the best wing backs in the game. You know, if you're playing... Four back, you know, a four three two one, for example, with overlapping full backs. This guy's about as good as it gets. If you're playing a five back, this guy's as good as it gets. He's just incredible. So quick, so good on the ball. Is defending not the best, but definitely still usable in that aspect. And he has the quick step playstyle plus, which means <clears throat> he is just outrageously quick uh, he has rapid as well just try this guy and you will not regret it we then have Lamptey this is actually one of my favorite defenders this year he's just coming in just below the 100k mark so I'm sneaking him into this video he's actually incredible um, I think he's one of them hidden gems that will like rise as the year goes on because he's a week one team of the week feels so quick in game so good on the ball because of that 99 balance and he's small defending's good and yes he does only have 43 strength which is just so weak but that aggression does make up for it uh, he has rapid and quick step and he also links to the evolutions and to fatty which i'm sure a lot of you guys have done so he's a good one then have a Kanji. This is if you're on a super cheap budget, four star weak foot, six foot two. Not too much to talk about, but he's just a solid centre back that you can get away with on a super cheap team. We then have a Raulho. What a player this guy is. Correct me if I'm wrong, by the way, but was he not six foot four last year? Um, I don't know what's happened there. I might be chatting waffle, but I'm pretty sure he was six foot four. So I have no idea what's happened there, but he's quick, defensively amazing, and physical beast as well. And look at these play styles, man. He has power header, jockey, the gold block, which is ridiculously OP, anticipate, slide tackle, acrobatic. The guy is just an absolute machine. We then have Alaba. Um, he's another sort of cheaper option. Um he has some really good links, you know, the Real Madrid guys. You've got like Modric, for example, Tushimeni. Just some really good options. Good pace, you know, excellent on the ball for a centre-back. Uh, defending's great, physically good. Uh, dead ball specialist as well. And anticipate. We then have Bolde. This guy's like 1k and he's legitimately one of the best fullbacks in the game. I can't believe what I'm seeing every time I come up against him. He feels incredible in game and I have no idea why. Um, you can actually also start him at right back, which I've seen a few people do. But he's super quick, super good on the ball, defensively good. And he's just, for a cheap fullback, like he's about as good as it gets. Jockey, anticipate and quick step. Marquinhos. I really like this guy, like every FIFA. I just think he's always super, super solid. Obviously, you have the PSG links as well, um, which are always, they just always have a good back line. You know, it's Nuno Mendes, Hakimi, Kimpembe, Marquinhos. It's just always good. So you've just got a full solid back line if you want to go there. But good pace, insane passing. He's good on the ball. Defending and physicals are nice. Uh, jockey, gold intercept, 
He's got Anticipate, Power Header, and Aerial as well. We move on to his team, mate. It is Kim Pembe, and this guy's a joke in game, man. Absolute joke. Six foot two. Which FIFA was it, by the way, where Kim Pembe was insane? You'll have to let me know in the comments. It was either last year or the year before, I believe. Um, but good pace, you know, solid defending, insane physically, and he does have that gold block, which is just super OP, intercept, and also the aerial play style. We then do have Hakimi, um, so that, that back line is right there, ready to use. We have left out Nuno, but, you know, he's he's very solid still. Uh, Four-star, four-star on Hakimi. It's like Davies in a way, you know, just rapid, good on the ball. Uh, but with Hakimi, you know, he's got really good finishing and stuff as well. Um, one of the better fullbacks in the game for sure. He does have the whipped pass trait, which is nice, or play style, I should say. Uh, quick step. And he's just a very solid option. Uh, we do then have Varane, who is incredible on this game, to be fair. He is just good, you know, every FIFA, isn't he? He's another one of those guys. Six foot three. Um, he's got the four star weak foot, which is good for playing out the back, but great pace, you know, solid enough passing, nothing too crazy, but it will do the job. And he's he's a bit stiff on the ball with that balance, I can't lie, but he's more of like a, an out and out defender who's also really good on the recovery pace. His defending's really nice. His jumping's really good considering his height, and he has good strength as well. Does have that gold anticipate. Uh, which improves the chances of tackle success. It's a really overpowered play style. Um, he does also have aerial. Um, so that is our selection. If I had to go through the absolute best ones, not in terms of value, but the best players, um, I think Saliba is ridiculous. Araujo is absolutely insane as well. Um, Varane is definitely up there. For me, this Lamptey is incredible but i'm sat there thinking you know if we're talking value he's probably not as good value as like a davies or a hakimi but i would definitely recommend him especially if you need that ansu fatty link but overall you can't really go wrong with any of these they're all very very decent options you know you can mix and match as well like a Raulho can link to bolde uh, you've got the psg guys obviously which can all link together get donnarumma and goal and then they're all basically sorted out for chemistry and overall this should help you guys out so let me know in the comments if you've tried any of these maybe you actually disagree with some of the players i've said here like they've had a stinker for you in the weekend league and you think i'm waffling do let me know but guys subscribe uh, for more videos to get better at fc24 i will catch you on the next one and peace